that little girl was me when she mm-hmm. remember when she went after Biden kind of disingenuously for being opposed to busing, which she was terrible on. It's just that she's not oh, yeah. pro busing as she likes to pretend. To hear you talk about the reputations of two United States senators who built their reputations and career on the segregation, you also worked with them to oppose busing. You know, there was a little girl in California who was part of the second class to integrate her public schools. And she was bused to school every day. And that little girl was me. There's great audio of him talking about why he opposes busing. And he, on an interview, or I don't remember if it was an interview when he was a senator or if it was a radio appearance or whatever, or public speech, but he actually tried to pull the like, it's assimilationist to bus, to do busing. It's a rejection of black is beautiful, of black pride. Oh, that was one of his, um tenants for rejecting yeah. it at the time that's yeah. pretty clever in a way i know he was like yeah. kind of proto woke proto like woke weapon weaponization woke yeah yeah i mean i'm sure he didn't mean it earnestly but no, of course uh, not. but I, it, of... it is ahead of its time in terms of like weaponizing identity politics for for like reactionary purposes i edited it into a podcast that i did about him i when i interviewed branco marchetic marchetic from Jackman. 32-year-old Joseph Biden of Delaware led the fight for the recent Senate anti-busing amendment. He says he did it because busing just isn't working. The concept of busing, which implicit in that concept, is a rejection of the whole movement of black pride, where black is beautiful, black culture should be studied. It's pretty devious and clever that he actually weaponized like black nationalism to... Um, I know, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, because... I've seen the other stuff, like I don't want my, you know, people um, being raised in a racial jungle and stuff. Right. But That's like the other side of it, right? Yeah, but that one is actually much uh, better. I'd love to know, know. who counseled it.